When the Indians score four runs, uh, they have an outstanding winning percentage. Problem is, uh, they haven't scored four runs a whole lot. Take a listen to Terry Francona talking about the offense so far this season. I just, again, some of it's youth. Some of us, we're trying to hit too many pitches. You know, sometimes you got to have a plan and stick to it. You can't hit everything. You know, they, they start going back and forth, fastball change up or slow curveball, and it really gives us a tough time. And, you know, we just – you got to be disciplined enough to, to know what you want to do and then not try to hit everything. Let's bring back in Matt Derry from 92.3 The Fan and the Derry Brothers Tribecast. And, and, and Matt, that's – the manager nailed it on the head. It's exactly yeah. correct. Uh, and to say this, Dave, I mean, he mentioned change-up. Um, this team trying to hit change-ups is a total mess. And, look, we're down on the offense because the last, really, four nights after the Jose home run to make it 4 nothing on Thursday really has gone south and hasn't provided enough pop. Um, but these teams are presenting a challenge of throwing change-ups at these guys. And like Tito said, the, the game plan and how to attack them or to lay off those pitches – they're not sticking to it. Some of it is youth. Uh, some of it is there. There just aren't enough good hitters in this lineup. You know, my brother on our on our podcast, and we have a new episode out today. Um, always jokes that I that I dislike Ahmed Rosario. I just don't think he's an everyday player. I don't think Jake Bowers is an everyday player. I don't think Harold Ramirez is an everyday player. I don't think Andres Jimenez is an everyday player. A lot of these guys are playing every day. Jordan Luplo is a specialist against lefties. And I know he's been better against righties, but he's hitting below 200. This team needs a shot in the arm. Um, they need a couple of bats that they can put out there every single day that are going to contribute. I don't know if it's trading for Joey Gallo or uh, bringing up Owen Miller right now, but th there need to be some, some more consistent bats in this lineup for this team to take that next step. And I know this year is kind of a transition year. They want to win, but they want to play young guys. Um, but there's, there's too many holes in this lineup right now. 